Hi, I'm Nick from Rick Science Cookery School here in Padstow, and I'm going to show you how to get the grit out of mussels and other bivalves. Uh, so the problem with um, mussels, and more with cockles and clams, but you can they be gritty. And if you um, open them up in a sauce and they've got grit in them, it's going to fall into the sauce and then every mouthful you're going to have a bit of grit. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, remove it. So we've got some cleaned mussels here that have been washed and the beard's taken off, all made sure they're nice and tightly closed. Um, and then we're going to open them up quickly with a bit of wine. So we've got a nice hot pan here with nothing in it, it's totally dry. Um, and if you put the mussels in, not a lot happens because the contact between the mussel and the shell is very small. So to help, we're going to put a little bit of white wine in with the mussels and then that's going to create steam in that pan and that's going to create heat all around the mussels and it's going to open them up a lot quicker, okay? So these are lovely mussels um, from uh, West Country Mussels in um, St Austell and they've got really, really thin shells so they cook incredibly quickly. So I think just about a minute or so and these are going to be cooked. Right, so all the mussels have opened up now so you can turn that off, take the lid off and what we're going to do is pour it straight through this colander here, like so, okay? And drain all that. So that's lovely mussel stock there. We want to use this mussel stock because it's got all the flavour in there from opening up the mussels. But if we put it into a jug like this and hold the jug up, any grit will sink to the bottom to that little corner. So you don't agitate it, don't stir it, and then all you want to do is start off your base for your mussels or your clams, whatever you're doing, put your hot mussels through there and then just siphon off all but the last teaspoon of that mussel liquor and then all the grit will be left behind there and it won't go into your final dish. So perfect if you're on, you know, don't ever open clams on top of a paella or anything like that at the end because if they've got grit in them they're going to drop that grit through that lovely paella you've worked really hard on. So if you open the clams like that Get your stock, use that to make your piler, fantastic, flavour it, but keep the grit out. And there we go.